pandas welcome back to my channel igtv so welcome back to my igtv and today is episode number can you please help me out kaun sa episode hai apna in the comment section below thank you so basically the whole purpose of making this video was that most of the times i'm so confused like i don't even know should i really be using a certain product or not should i repurchase it should i buy it should i not buy it should i buy this one should i not buy this one because there is so many products in the market so today i'm actually going to tell you uh, very simply what these products are the one which i'm definitely going to be repurchasing in the year 2020 like i have used it before and i've loved them so if i have to spend my money again these are the products that i definitely will on so let's start with my first product so the first product that i'm definitely going to be spending my money again on is my sunscreen which is la shield this sunscreen i have been using on um, since 3 4 years now and it's been so good i mean it's actually worth the money so this is the one i have i think shown uh, this to you guys even earlier so basically this is going to cost you somewhere around Last time I bought it was for some nine ninety five bucks, but trust me, this is like the best sunscreen ever. If you have oily skin, dry skin, whatever skin, La Shield is the thing for you guys. Okay. So black number two that I'm definitely buying in twenty twenty has to be both of this. So this is my foundation from Wet n Wild, and this one I got from Maybelline Superstay, which is costing seven fifty. And Wet n Wild was I think cheaper; it was around three ninety nine or something. But both of these are everything. Like so, even if it's hot, I stay in Mumbai, and it's a little humid as well. This foundation really stays. This helps to just make my skin look like more clear. So I kind of mix this two these days, but both of them are like. product that I definitely use for this 2020 has got to be the stick from sugar i mean it's uh, ace of face the best part about this product obviously it's a stick so it's easy so whenever i am getting late and i really need to put things on my face so this is the one that i use the best part about this is this brush that comes i mean i have to show this to you guys it's so smooth like so if i have this and if i have to blend it it's so good like just look at it it blends so well so this brush is like really nice it really does work like that of a beauty blender so if this gets over definitely buy it well it's going to be summers and also it's going to be a lot of golden out of stores girls so apparently a lot of you guys have asked me about a highlighter uh, there are a lot of highlighters in the market a lot of expensive ones but if i have to purchase one highlighter once again this is not got over yet but agar ye khatam hua to main zarur khareedungi which is this highlighter i love this highlighter i mean it's like see I love it. I I have used it and it's from Wet and Wild again. Uh not that expensive. You can check it on Nykaa. I don't really remember. Oh yeah, it's 4.99, which is good money for highlighter and this really stays on. Well, I'm sure there are loads of eyeshadows in the market, but these two stand the best. I will not buy the silver one. Uh this one is actually from Swiss Beauty, but I will definitely go ahead with this golden one because I can use this one like every day. So like every day you just want natural look or whatever the shit look that you want in your face. This is the good. So yeah, this I will repurchase for sure. This is something which I will definitely repurchase. I mean, there are a lot of left. Pata nahi ab khatam ho gaye. Lekin agar honge to main zarur khareedungi. These are the beauty blenders. So I have actually got them from Miniso for two fifty bucks, which is not very expensive. And the best part is, if I have to go travel, I can just take one of these beauty blenders and have multiple uses for the same thing rather than picking a heavy beauty blender. So this one. big thumbs up i am somebody who's really crazy when it comes to mascaras because i've got really bad lashes so i always like to keep my lashes thick and heavy and then there is this one mascara that i can never live without which is uh, from l'oreal actually so the best part about this mascara is like it's got step 1 which is this primer kind of a thing um, it really defines my lashes because i've got very thin lashes so it makes it look thicker and then i've got the step 2 that is a normal mascara so it helps to pull it out and everything so if this gets over that i'm definitely repurchasing this one every one of us loves kajal and we all these thing yaar koi aisa kajal bata do jo smudge na ho well i don't really like nykaa products a lot to be very frankly speaking but then this one um which is the nykaa um 
I am bold kajal. It was recommended to me by a makeup artist, and trust me, it's really nice. So the best part about this uh, kajal is that it does not spread. I mean, I don't know if you're going to be bleeding or sweat, but otherwise, it does not really smudge. And if I don't know, I mean, I don't even know if this is going to get over. I mean, it's going to take a lot of time. But uh, yeah, if I, I would want it back again. That's what I mean. Um yeah so this is it for the video wait until my next video which is definitely going to be on eyeliners and it's a very very long video but it's very informative and it's about the best eyeliners that I've used till date techniques to apply and a lot of different things okay and do let me know in the comment below if you have any other product uh, that you will definitely give a try to repurchase in the year 2020 Oh, one minute. I think I forgot to tell you guys about one product. Wait, 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 wait. So this one is from Body Shop. You know the the tint. So I had one earlier, which was in the shade Pomo Granite. वो पूरा खत्म हो गया. फिर मैंने buy करने का try किया तो वो out of stock था. फिर I took this one, Hibiscus Pink, uh, from Body Shop. The cheek tints. And lip tints, I don't use it. Usually use it for the lips, so for the chipsy, uh, cheeks, yes. <sighs> This one, I'll buy the red one, but I will definitely repurchase. In fact, I'm gonna go to Nike and just buy it right away. Yeah. So now I'm finally done with the video. I'll see you next time with another video. Bye.